Hello everyone and welcome. In this video we're going to be talking about Octane Rating, Ron, Mon, and AKI. Now several people have been commenting and saying, hey, why does Europe have higher, so much higher Octane Rating fuels than in the US? Uh, this actually isn't the case at all. They're all actually the same, but we use a different labeling system, and so that's what I'm going to be explaining in this. And apologies as there's no fun pictures to look at, but it is an important topic and pretty simple to understand. So let's talk about RON first. RON is the research octane number. And basically what this is, is it's an engine and it has a variable compression ratio. And so you increase the compression ratio until it begins to knock. And then you measure it where it knocks. And based on when it knocks, gives it its octane number. And what you're comparing it to is a mixture of isooctane and heptane. So a mixture of purely isooctane by volume, 100% isooctane, will have a 100 octane rating number. If you have a 95% isooctane mix with 5% heptane, that's 95% or 95 uh, rating research octane number. So if you have a fuel that knocks uh, at the same time that a 95% isooctane fuel knocks, then you would rate that other fuel a 95 as the research octane number. So this is the number that Europe posts on pumps, and that's why this number is higher, because this is the higher of the two numbers. Now MON is the motor octane number, and this is some more severe testing with the engine, and one of the things you'll be changing is the ignition timing. So as you advance the timing, it's more prone to knock, and so you measure when that occurs, and that gives you the motor octane number. So this number is typically a lot lower than the research octane number, as the research octane number isn't as challenging of a test. So with this lower number, uh, basically in the US what we do is we take the average of the RON and MON, so that's the anti-knock index. So here, for our example, let's say the same fuel that got a 95 on this one got a 87 on the MON test, the motor octane number, 95 plus 87 divided by 2, 91. So in the US you would see posted 91 as the octane rating, whereas in Europe you would see 95. And this is just an example. That doesn't mean anytime you see something in Europe that's rated 95, it's 91 in the US. Um, it, based, it varies based on the fuel, uh, and so just note that this is an example, and all I'm trying to prove here is that in the US the number will be lower because it's an average rather than the higher of the two numbers, which is the research octane number. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below.